keep it shiny. What did you do? I got to brush my teeth like this. And they're shiny now. Oh. And I'm not going to let them fall out. Good job. Are you guys scared? Lord God. Because I'm going through a lot of pain? <laughs> Maple! I'm so proud of you and guys. And I'm so nice to my sister. Mm -hmm. Good morning, guys. Um, this is the second day um, of me my having hand. my teeth my pulled hand. out. Yeah. Today is Thursday. I got them pulled Tuesday. Um, right now, I'm okay. It is 7.51, but I woke up around 5 o'clock, like, dying. The pain was unbearable. I could not do anything. I woke my husband up. Right now, I feel a little nauseous, but I'm okay. But I'm going to make the kids some breakfast right now. Some sausages. I'm going to make some eggs. Nothing fancy. I'm going to try to talk to you guys as best as possible. So this is what I wanted to kind of say, like, for those of you who don't know, I do have my videos monetized, I guess, which means, like, you'll get paid for them or whatever, but I've never made money on YouTube. I'm nowhere near making money on YouTube, and that's fine. I didn't start YouTube to make money. I started YouTube so I could record portions of our day. And so we have videos for the future. I work my ass off and so does my husband to make money. Before, I worked two jobs in Texas. So I'm used to working. Um, if I ever made money off YouTube, hey, that would be cool. Do I rely on YouTube to make money? Hell no, I don't care. Um, I appreciate all the followers, the subscribers, the supporters, the people who like us and enjoy watching us. I really appreciate that. I didn't have a lot before. I think I only had like 107 before Kiara shouted us out. Jesus. Come back here. Come Adrian? All right. I bet you he's hiding. Oh, he came to the garage. So like I was saying, I really appreciate like all the followers and everything. I only had like a hundred and maybe a hundred and seven before Kiara tried this out and sent all you lovely people my way, which I really enjoy you guys. I didn't have that many before, so I, I didn't interact with a lot of people on YouTube. And now that I have all these people that watch us now, you guys talk to me a lot more and it's really nice. Like I really like talking to you guys. I like hearing what you have to say how you feel or like conversating with you guys now I don't mean to come off wrong or disrespectful or rude but I'm a hundred percent myself on there the only thing that I don't post on YouTube is every little single detail of my relationship or every tiny little detail about my family. Like, I just don't think that I need to do that. It's not necessary to me to post every little thing that happens with us. Other than that, I'm 100% myself. I'm a little louder in person. I don't think me being really loud on a camera is necessary. So, I've heard people say before, like, well, be yourself, people like that, or I am myself. But when I'm around other people, I'm a, I tend to be a little louder. On camera, talking to myself and talking to you guys, there's no need for me to be loud and stuff. Like, it's just okay, not needed. Let's go. Number two. <laughs> yeah. Other than that, like, things that you guys say I do not hurt me. Two. I do like constructive criticism. That's okay. Say what you feel. Say what you want. I'll take it in. But... All right, guys. So, I really want to make cube steak. <clears throat> Um, in sauce and I add like a whole bunch of onions and stuff like that and it's like another one of my husband's favorites I'm gonna show you guys what I do to prep it okay so I have my cube steak right here and I'm gonna tenderize it guys my tooth is hurting so bad
So I'm going to keep doing that. I'm going to keep tenderizing it and then I'll show you guys what I do next. gonna be so good and why do I add vinegar I have no clue I just do it was very little but when I put it in a pan and I put the onions a little bit of water and olives and sauce it's gonna be delicious so I'm just gonna go ahead I'll tell you guys I took that Percocet so now I feel a little bit nauseous and my mouth still hurts but I'm gonna go ahead and clean some of the dishes and um, let the food marinate I'm about to put it in the fridge and then um, I'm gonna tell my husband to buy rice or something so we can make our potatoes. But I have to work tonight, so I don't know how this is gonna work. But we will see. We'll make it happen. We'll make it work. Alright, so while I was washing dishes, I felt like really nauseous and my head started to hurt. So I came to lay down. I think the perk set is starting to hit me, so I'm gonna try to take a little nap until my husband comes home so then I can cook and then get ready for work. Yeah. This happens every time I take this pill. For real. I feel so sick. I hate taking these perks up. You know what sucks, what doesn't help, is that it's that time of the month, too. <sighs> help me, Lord. So it's about to go down. In here. What are we making, you ask? Not quite sure. Mm-hmm. So this, this is a cube steak, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And then I'm um, doing my little concoction of mixture of noodles we don't have usually we would eat this steak and onions with sauce um we would eat it with rice and beans but we don't have any rice or beans and neither one of us want to go out so he's gonna try it with pasta yeah, oh, yeah no, it'll come out good <laughs> it, it always does leave it here because i need that what are you doing with it oh yeah so i'm gonna cut up i just cut up some garlic right here and i'm gonna cut up some onions it's probably the bottom of the thing the burner was probably dirty Okay, put it on the Okay, so. Why are you laughing? Oh. Why is that okay? Probably like oil got on it or something. Yeah. You can lift it up and take like that. You can take the sponge and clean it. Every time he gets in the kitchen, he wants to burn things. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, it's not even that. I think it's underneath. Oh, I mean, this is how they had to do it back in the old days. <laughs> Fledge fire and they'd be like, oh shit, like that. No, we just get oh my god, Joey! Oh my god! He's burning the kitchen, guys! <laughs> He's gonna... Oh, I went out. We're just gonna turn that off. That's crazy. You want to do it again? No, no. Turn it off. Okay, let's do it out here. Mommy, let's get you, baby. Come here. What did I say? Come here, please. Natalia, go over there. You don't know how to listen. Go over there, mommy. She's just working on her voice to start singing. That's it. <laughs> 
Alright, so I'm gonna put in the garlic. Ooh, girl, put in that garlic, girl. <laughs> no, I think it's today. Weird because I've been keeping up my hair. You have it? Shopping. Yes, we do. I got paid. Huh? I got paid. Today? Yeah. Oh wow, you could have run out and got a thing of rice? Like Cheap little bastard. <laughs> I'm gonna put some onions in here. God, that garlic smells good. Yeah, it does. Can I got. I think I bit my tongue sleeping last night. Oh yeah? It had the worst bump on the side of it. Oh, you? Quite good. Yeah, I got it. Hey, my onions are wet. Can you sprinkle some of this? Yeah, yeah. And I'm putting a bay leaf in here. Who um, the devil never eat those? Come on. Come rush me. Sorry. Oh, what is that you're doing there? Huh? What is that? This is cilantro. Dry Usually cilantro. I use like regular fresh. fresh cilantro, but I don't have any, so. And I'm gonna put a little bit of oregano. It smell like you know when it's fresh either. Yeah. So, thank you. So, I'm gonna let that cook up in there. I'm about to add the steak right on top. Guys, oh. all the other seasoning that I put and the onions and the garlic, that's all optional. You don't have to do this. Oh, this yeah. is just what I do. <laughs> you don't have to do any of this. You can just season your steak. This looks so good. I'm gonna see. I know. Okay. Again, you don't have to do this. I'm just doing it. This is gonna make this. I play flour. The flour is gonna make the sauce thicken up a little bit. That was my original idea with the noodles. What? To use the, the steak and onion sauce, mm -hmm. thicken it up a little bit. So I put like the steak on top of the noodles, it has like... A sauce? Yeah. Okay. And now I'm adding some water. Mm -hmm. For you? Yeah, you're going to make me that. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's really good. And now, uh, you're just supposed to cover hey, it. you got to do me a favor? you got to do like destroy your house. Yeah, so pretty good. Cool. A little more, and then we like seasoning, okay? So I'm just gonna add that, and then a few more onions on top. Don't tell me wait, get up and go. Oh, someone's in trouble. I'm gonna try to pull up that hands off. He's such a softie, shut up. Yeah. Alright, and then I need the top. Straight. Pull it. Roger. Maybe. No. Okay. Now I literally just leave it just like that. Top it. And just let it cook. And I let it cook like that. Oh my god, my face looks so lopsided and fat. Oh my god. Even though all the amount of ice I put on it. Um, I top it and I just let it cook for about an hour or so and um, when it's done I add a lot more onions on top and I close it and let the onions get soft and then you can either put sauce in it or you can just eat it like that and it's done. Never said I'm hungry. Can't wait for it. So, yeah. I ate a bag of popcorn today. That was my... Alright guys, so... It's pretty much done. I could leave it in there for a couple more hours so that it get even softer, but it's done. I'm gonna go ahead and, like I told you guys, throw in the onions. In there, so whenever they're ready to eat, they can just go ahead and get. It. 
So now with all these onions, I'm just gonna throw them in here, cover it. You know the rear is on. I'm gonna need that in a minute. Mm-hmm. So And for those of you who don't like onion, I'm telling you, like, just putting the onions in here makes a big difference. If you don't put them, if you don't eat them, don't eat them when you serve yourself. But putting on onions in here makes such a big difference. So I'm going to go ahead and close it. And they'll be done, like, when the onions are translucent. It'll be done. And that's it. They're getting nice and soft. They're getting nice and soft. The poor man's plate because this doesn't go with pasta. But like I said, we don't have rice, so. Alright, try it and let me know what you think. Yeah, right there. Yeah, it's right. Mm -hmm. Ouch. Oh, yeah. I'll crush that. It's good? Mm hmm. Okay, good. No, you need to I get some of Oh, this is yours. Okay. I just want to make green noodles. I like it. <laughs> Are the green noodles good? Guys, I'm in so much pain today. I don't even know right now how I'm even functioning. Look at this. You see how swollen this is right here and right here? Mm, it hurts so bad. <laughs> I'm gonna have a killer migraine. I really don't think that I'm gonna be okay going to work today, but I'm probably just gonna try to be honest. I need that money. And I don't know. I just feel like shit. If you have time out of your day to pick out every single little thing you don't like in somebody's video, you honestly really do need to get a life. But, really. but. Regardless, you did good, you're awesome. Way to go, YouTube police. You're the one, okay? Might want to go to CIA, FBI, any one of the agencies there, put your resume in, put this clip on there, you know, so that you feel so good about yourself. Good job. I'll be the first one to congratulate you. Matter of fact, when you get into the academy, I might even pin you. You know, your first rank, you know? Okay, shut sure. Good job. But anyways. <laughs> if you don't like what we post, or what we do, or how we are, forced to watch. don't watch us. Simple. We're not perfect. We don't pretend to be. Yeah, we really don't fucking pretend to be <laughs> perfect. Shit's gonna happen. <laughs> Happened. Oh my god. See? We ain't perfect. <laughs> I can't talk. Hang on, baby talk. girl. Hold on. She's a brat. She's my brat. My face is so swollen. Thanks, babe, for giving me food. And look what he got me, guys. Last time I helped her. Right? The cold time was a little bit. I threw up, remember, right after? Yeah, you did. So I ate half of it. He bought me one yesterday. Yes, princess. I was this close to, like, eating it. You want to taste good? it? Okay, give me a second. I want to do that. In the field, though. How many times have I picked up food that fell on the floor? Oh, so you found the. Are you just talking to. The... You know what? I, don't, I was just talking to anybody who listens, really. Oh, so I don't listen to you? you did you. What, uh, what did I say? In the field one time, you picked something up off the floor? Why are you good? Where are you going? Say... Can I get myself some? Yeah, where are you going, though? The shop in. I don't know yet. I don't want to take that much time in there. What happened to Doritos? Mommy, what were you going to do? I don't know. What did you say? Mommy, what were you going to do? 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 Mommy, what were you going to do?
Nothing, baby. Because I can tell in my face I'm getting fat. Me too, look. And and I feel like my face, I'm getting fat. Like it's an advanced stage. Like it's terminal fatness. Mm. I love you too. You mean parent? (laughs) I'm just kidding. I'm not a mean parent. Yes, I am. I'm actually more strict than you are. Yeah, I'm pretty strict. No, oh, he's yeah, not. Yeah, I am. Yeah, yeah, on, on certain things. Right? No, yes. he is. Yes. No. Yes. He... I can argue with you all day and I can win it because you're hurting. So, oh. He is the nice parent. The I'm going to step all over you, dad parent. No. Yes. No. I you like, see, no. Maddie is like a mini me. Maddie would be like, dad, I told you no. <laughs> it is her. Me, I'd be like, girl, you better wipe that little. Oh, but when it's time for me to get body. on and pop it and get, you know, the pop it, I get the pop it. Don't let him lie to you guys. It hurts. I cry. Don't let him lie to you. This yeah. man but is. But I get it on and pop it. I mean, have you ever felt anything softer than a marshmallow, softer than a pillow, softer than a feather? That's this man. Can, I cannot be soft when it comes to my kids. Like, I discipline them. I do. I do that. Okay? Let them know. Let them know. You want to know what he does? Mm-hmm, hey, go to your room. You're grounded. Five minutes later, Dad comes outside. they run in yeah. fear. They run in fear. Of the mama coming. I put the fear of... I feel so bad. You guys want to know why? Because, like, one day he had them on Friday and Saturday or whatever, and I was at my friend's house. And when I came home, it was like all fun was over. It was like, oh man, Mom's home. I felt so bad. I felt like crap. Then I was like... Do you guys want to stay with me? Do you guys want to stay with dad? They're like, we like dad better. Can I have my thing back? Thank you. Do you like it? Small series, but I do discipline when I need to. I do. Once a year, maybe? You know what? I just can't be serious around this one, you know? Because she's just, just taking it away from me. But she is way yeah. more. Yeah, hang on, which we stopped. You just tried it, crazy. Now, when it comes to, you know, boys around my daughters, I do not play that shit. But there is no boys around my daughters. Nope. Hey guys, I am currently on my way to work. It is 9.56. I have to be there at 10, but they give us like a grace period of nine minutes. So hopefully I'll make it then. I'll make it there in time. I am in excruciating pain right now, but I brought my Moltrin and I brought my Percocet and I brought my big ass ice pack and I should be okay. But I wanna let them know like once I get there, I don't know how much I'm gonna be able to do for them. Um, because like just time my shoe was giving me a headache and throbbing pains. So We'll see. Oh, well, I am at work, guys. And, yeah. Hurting like crazy. He said I can go home whenever I'm ready, whenever I'm done. So I'm going to go ahead and finish my online training. And then I'm probably going to go home. Me at work. I'm in so much pain. But every hour here, where it counts. <laughs>